Hello friends and welcome back to Food Venture Folks. Well, Christmas is just around the corner and I'm going to share with you the recipe which I usually make during Christmas. So it's the Christmas special chicken curry which is made with very simple ingredients and it goes very well with sannas or any Indian bread. And the beauty of this curry is that it has got such a nice rustic aroma that its flavors will certainly dwell on your palate. So let's begin with the preparation and I hope you guys don't skip any part of the video and continue watching the video right till the end. on the subscribe button and hit the bell icon. Now we'll brine the chicken and for that I've taken 1.2 kgs of chicken here and I've just made a few gashes over the chicken pieces as you can see. Now into this we'll add water till all the chicken pieces are nicely submerged. Now I'm going to add salt. teaspoon of sugar, half a teaspoon of baking soda and three teaspoons of vinegar. Now mix all of it nicely. Now we we'll let this rest for at least six hours. So after 6 hours, we'll discard all the excess water from this chicken and this is how the chicken pieces would look like. Now we'll add some salt as per taste, a teaspoon of turmeric powder. Now mix all of this nicely and we'll keep this aside for at least 15 minutes. make the masala for the chicken curry. For that, I have taken two handful of garlic pods which are sliced, three sliced onions, one scraped coconut, eight green chilies which are slit and half dry scraped coconut. Now we will move on to the dry ingredients. So I have taken one teaspoon of black peppercorns. 4 teaspoon of coriander seeds, 2 teaspoon of white sesame seeds, 2 teaspoon of cumin seeds, 2 black cardamom pods, and half a teaspoon of cloves. Now we'll dry roast all these ingredients into a non-stick pan except the slit green chilies.
as the masala gets roasted you will see that there's a nice aroma that gets released and that's the time when you need to turn off the flame and let the masala cool down for a while So the masala has cooled down and we need to grind this into a smooth paste but before we do that I'm going to add around a handful of coriander leaves and then grind it. Now the paste is ready. So the very first thing that we do is we'll begin by adding around 4 tablespoons of oil in this vessel. Now we'll add around 3 roughly chopped onions. Now saute the onions. Now we'll add around a handful of curry leaves. Mix it nicely. Now we'll add these 8 slit green chilies. I have taken 1 teaspoon of Kashmiri red chilli powder and added some water into it and mixed it nicely so that the Kashmiri red chilli powder doesn't burn. So we will add that paste and mix it well. And now it's time to add the chicken curry paste which we made earlier. Give all of that a good quick mix. Now we'll add the leftover water from the mixy jar. Now we'll add the marinated chicken pieces. I'm going to add half a cup of tamarind pulp. And some salt as per taste. Now mix everything nicely. Now we'll add around 2 teaspoon of homemade chicken masala. Well you can use any kind of chicken masala or garam masala which is readily available. Now I'll add a glass of water. We'll also add a teaspoon of dry kasuri methi because that will give an aromatic flavor to our chicken curry.
Our Christmas special chicken curry is ready. So let's do the plating. Wow! Its aroma is simply divine. Click on the subscribe button and hit the bell icon. So I'm going to serve the chicken curry with the sanas and you can find the sana recipe on the playlist of my channel which I've already uploaded earlier. So friends, I hope you all have enjoyed watching the Christmas special chicken curry recipe. Do try making it at home and let me know by your comments what was your experience of making this beautiful recipe. If you are a first time viewer then do give a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel food venture folks also please share this video with your family and friends on facebook whatsapp instagram or twitter thanks for joining me today signing off for now i will see you soon in my next video until then wishing everyone a joyful christmas season